the team selling tickets will be at the Jay City Ballroom. Um, you're all welcome to come. It's going to be a wonderful experience. Um, big cracking from the beginning to the end. So we're going to have MC H Ricky from Kenya. MC Jesse will be there as well. Pasha is here with us from Kenya. Celeste Nsuli, we're waiting for Celeste. She's from South Africa. Churchill, obviously, um, our very own. Because of him, that's why we're doing this. Jack who's right here next to me from Kenya, Dr. Hillary from Uganda, Salvador, who just arrived from the airport and came straight to the press conference. Thank you. <laughs> Mitch, also right here, not to far from me from Kenya. Arnold Xavier, also from Kenya. Oga Bachelor from Nigeria, but also representing Kenya. Kyutube from Zimbabwe, welcome. And Loisa Gola from South Africa, welcome. So, how we plan this press conference? Um, we're going to start with the team sitting in the middle where Churchill is. Um, and then we'll talk to the team sitting in the middle. After that, we move the microphones to that side to hear from the people on that side. And then after that, we move the microphones to this side. So, I think maybe Eric could just start and then um, tell us with Joanna. Yes. So I think everybody wants to hear from the horse's mouth, you know, we want to hear from you, Church. This has been something that Black Festival has been doing um, four years now. What's different this year? Um, how do you feel about Black Festival? Great. Welcome to Black um, Festival. <coughs> this should be the fourth edition. I took a break because of COVID and uh, now we're back. So exciting that uh, for the very first time again in a long time we have the top African stand-up comedians on one stage. And uh, the message here is uniting Africa, Africa uh, through humor. You see comedy has really uh, uh, developed. When we started it was all about tribal, you remember? Then we did um, mimicking politicians, what we were doing was ridiculous. And now this new era is about uh, storytelling and uh, skits, what Crazy Kenya does. So now, for stand-up comedy, is more storytelling, and these are the finest comedians we have in Africa at the moment. This show will be broadcast on your local television channel, uh, because uh, it shows a new era of how we're going to communicate, and we just want to place comedy as a premier product. So, as you've noticed with time, uh, people are moving from offline to online. Because I asked you, when was the last time you watched television? It's been a minute, right? And so uh, that gives an advantage to content creators. And moving forward, content will be king. Content will become a currency. And so we're excited that we can package a premium product that can be showcased uh, later on in um, premium channels. And of course, I hope that's going to translate a lot. Uh, uh, in the pockets of our content creators. So thank you so, so much for being part of this. The Laugh Festival uh, fourth edition. And next year is gonna be bigger. We are gonna have a bigger, bigger act coming uh, through. And we hope you're going to join us there. Today, uh, we start a beautiful journey again, uh, Black Festival, uh, with these amazing comedians from across Africa. Thank you so much for taking time. I'm sure you're gonna hear from them. And I'm sure the audience is uh, pregnant. Is it expectant? <laughs> <laughs> to hear from them. Asante sana, nakarubuli sana, la pusoto. Four. Representing Zimbabwe, how are you feeling? How are you doing? Um, tell us about you know where you come from. Tell us about being here. You know, what should we expect tonight? Uh, thank you, thank you for having me. It's uh, an honor, a privilege to be here. Um, thank you to Mr. Churchill for the invite. It's a beautiful country you have, uh, you know, even though, I mean, everywhere is more prettier than sin. So, you know, I'm, <laughs> I'm always glad when I'm outside of Zimbabwe. Uh, what, what to say about Zim? It's, yeah, it's full of corruption. Uh, <laughs> it's, like, it's everything you hear about it is true. Um, you know, but it's a beautiful place for beautiful people and to connect with people who are just as beautiful and very welcoming and I can't wait to experience the audience and uh, bring what I bring to the table and it shall be fun. Well, thank you so much for being here. Um, 
Like if you want to go out, you say, I don't trust As long as you add Sana. Excited to be back. Uh, I think I've, I've, I've been part of all the love uh, festivals since inception, and uh, to be called back again shows that at least uh, there's been a consistency in what I've been doing. So, thank you so much, Ashil. Uh, of course, it's going to be a beautiful show. I've worked with almost every comedian here, and I know how good they are. So, just be ready for an action packed night uh, full of laughter. I, I, I find it funny when people ask, what should we expect? Like, we are comedian. <laughs> <laughs> expect jokes. <laughs> it's not like we're going to fly, fire, what you know. It's just going to be jokes. Mm -hmm. So yeah, don't, don't ask that question. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you come with special guests. Yes. Who are you rolling with? That's a joke. Yeah, I'm super rolling with the, the, the one I rehearsed my jokes for. <laughs> my wife. What can you come? Yeah, he's over there. That's how we make our money. Come and show us. Hello. You can see. That is the mother of some of my children. <laughs> <laughs>